This is the first software engineer. This is Margaret Hamilton, and she led the team that designed the flight control systems for the NASA program. She was the person that invented the term software engineering because she was trying to convince all of the physical engineers that it required some engineering. At the time, they were thinking, oh, we'll do all this stuff. You just write some software. That's easy, right? And ultimately, she saved the Apollo 11 program because she introduced some failure cases. If you're a nerd like me, you might remember the 1201 alarms or the 1202 alarms on the descent, which were abort alarms. They were saying that the, sy the system's not working. She'd built that in. She'd thought about the ways in which her system might go wrong and wondered what would happen if it did. And she realized that it's very likely that this very, very primitive crude computer could probably get overloaded. So she built some software that would shed load. It would discard unnecessary jobs and stick to the essential. That saved the mission.